All right, guys, it is a spectacularly gorgeous day here in the end times. Uh, Monday morning, January 4th, 2016. So I just finished my economic meltdown roundup rant where I went around, I think, looking at like 10 or 12 stories about how the global industrial economy is bringing down a planet. But I noticed that virtually every story that I clicked on on uh, Yahoo News today, off to the side, they, uh, they have this little column called What to Read Next, trending, trending over and over and over again here on Monday morning, uh, I finally had to click on it. They were that Yahoo News was so insistent that I click on this story. I finally did to see what their panties were in such a wad about. And so I'm just going to share with you the number one trending story on, uh, on planet Earth according to the mainstream media today. This is one, uh, of course, if this had been here for Saturday. I can't wait till Saturday for this story, guys, for my clueless meltdown roundup rant where we see the number one trending story this Monday morning. <clears throat> Selena Gomez enjoys bikini-clad vacation while Justin Bieber packs on PDA with Haley Baldwin. There you go. I have no clue, and it never explains what the hell PDA means. And no clue what Justin Bieber packs on PDA with Haley Baldwin. Never heard the name Haley Baldwin. All right. While Justin Bieber was vacationing with his new girlfriend, Haley Baldwin, his ex, Selena Gomez, had a getaway of her own. On the same day that the Sorry singer posted a pic of himself kissing Stephen Baldwin's daughter, Gomez shared a sexy bikini pic of herself posed with a few of her gal pals. Quote, left my phone behind to be present. Good for you, Selena. Selena actually left her smartphone behind. Oh. As Selena Instagrammed her 59 million Instagram followers, 59 million followers. Meanwhile, Baldwin and Bieber posted a slew of PDA pics. PDA. PDA. I, uh, good God. Baldwin and Bieber posted a slew of PDA pics over the holiday season, but the 21-year-old pop star made it official when he shared an image of him locking lips with a 19-year-old model. Gigi Hadid, who is dating former One Direction member Zayn Malik, excitedly reacted to the Instagram pic, writing, quote, Okay, 
I am so down for this. Ben with Z today. Fuck it up. Hails. Double date is definitely happening. I have no clue. And while Bieber is fueling the romance rumors, Gomez has been shooting them down. Yep, so let's look at the top comment out of 971 comments to this story. This is John Chakarian. What do you have to say about this, John? Good God, these people are so irrelevant. It is pitiful the press pays any of them any intention, any attention. But I have to say, now that he clicked on the story, that both Selena and Haley are both 10 times hotter than Kim Cal Trashian is or has ever been. In fact, they are much hotter than any Cal Trashian slash Jenner trash. Kim has a face like a baboon and a butt like one that belongs on an elephant. Is it my imagination or is that horror Kim Katrashian getting her skin darkened the same way as Michael Jackson got his skin lightened? You are not black, Kim, but you are a disgrace. There you go, and there's Thomas. I would normally ask, who cares about this story? But I guess I do, because here I am commenting on these two idiots. The truth is that I am jealous that Yahoo News and the rest of the world doesn't come to my house to photograph what I'm doing on my vacation. Here is Tucker. I pity the fools who write these articles. Tudor. I'll be so glad when Beeper disappears. Worthless trash. And don't forget Walrus. Poor little Selena turning into just another hungry for a attention Hollywood exhibitionist tramp. There you go. For anybody uh, just curious what the number one trending story on planet Earth here on the first Monday morning of 2016 is. Can't say that you didn't hear it first, unless you've already read the story yourself, of course, from your old clueless doomsday moron who has no clue what P-D-A means. But anyway, I'm going to wrap up this rant and get to some pancakes. Smoke them if you got them, guys. Uh, the end is near. <sighs> Bye, guys.